Hi everyone and welcome to my next tutorial. This video is a contest entry for Heather Mouse's 300 likes contest and the theme was Welcome to the circus which I had to enter because I love circus and um, this is such a beautiful theme to create a new look and this is my final look. I tried to edit uh, some clownish stuff, some harlequin like stuff. Um, I added a head which could be a head from a ringmaster. I added a lace a lace piece which turns the whole theme into circus a little bit more. more. I um, added some stripes because I I think the most uh, circus tents are actually striped and this is my final look. Um, a little bit complementary colors with red and green and yeah that's all. If you like to know how I got this look done please stay tuned. And here I am. I did some preparations at first. As always, I covered my eyebrows for this look. I'm gonna set you a link right here. How to block out your eyebrows. Um, I drew lots of guidelines to um, just follow my concept um, with the white eye and a pen. And the next step is I will take my groomer's um, paint stick in G0 and just paint the areas in some areas around my nose or on my cheeks and on the forehead um, with this stick because I want to have um, an idea of foundation um, uh, not a pale, yeah, of course a pale foundation, not a white foundation and yeah, that's the next step I'm gonna do And here I am back again. The foundation is applied and therefore I used a foundation brush and a cosmetic sponge. The cosmetic sponge is just to smooth it out a little bit more and uh, yeah, just to hide those wipes from the foundation brush. And now I'm going to take my Grimace Cream Makeup in black, which is 101, and in green, which is number 407. And yeah, several uh, sharp angled acrylic brushes and makeup brushes, of course, and some small ones, some big ones, and just go onto um, the areas which are not covered with foundation, and yeah, just go and paint my pattern, which is going to be black and green, and yeah, most of stripes. Um, I just wanted to keep a stripey pattern. And yeah, that's the next step I'm going to do.
And here I am back again. Yeah, um, before I go on with painting my stripes in green and black on my cheeks, I will do my eye makeup with um, a primer by Kaiko, which I apply at first, and then I take my um, NYX Cosmetics Jumbo Pen in Milk, number 604, just to let the colors more pop, and I will also take translucent powder, just get it un under my eye, onto my cheeks, a thick layer, because I don't want to destroy the rest of my makeup with uh, eyeshadow pigments, so that's the next step I'm going to do. Here I am back again, just for a short time, my eyeshadow is finished, I'm gonna add some Grimace eyelashes later, and now I go on with painting my cheeks and my chin. And here I am back again. I turned a little bit fast for it because this look took 100 hours and now I'm yeah finished. I um, painted my cheeks as you can see. I smoothed the edges out a lot all around my makeup. I 
added some sequence. I added, of course, Grimace eyelashes in number 155. And now, yeah, I am finished. Um, I'm gonna get a neck piece on and my hat, and then I am back. And here I am again. This is my final look. I got it done. Just four or five hours of work, which is nothing. Well, um, I added a hat and a neck piece, and this is my final look. I got it done, finally. And if you like what you see, uh, leave me a comment below if you want to subscribe subscribe um, leave me feedback as always and I would say bye bye see you next time